Hi everyone. Today I am going to talk about few books on gardening. कई बार हमें लगता है कि gardening में है क्या कुछ सीखने को, isn't it? Many of us might be thinking that there is no need to learn gardening because it's a very basic thing and very simple. Procedure to grow a plant that anyone can do. You may be true, but uh, frankly speaking, no activity, even if it's a hobby, is complete unless you take care of technical aspects. So, इसलिए आज मैं आपको अपना personal talk दिखा रहा हूँ books का. जो गार्डनिंग से रिलेटेड है अभी यहां पे आप देख रहे हैं ये हेल्प्स दैट हील देन आयुर्वेदा और एक और बुक है आयुर्वेदा अनरेवल्ड तो ये हेल्प्स ऑफ की बुक्स और आयुर्वेदा की है अल्दो इट इज नॉट रिलेटेड टू गार्डनिंग but sometimes when we talk about herbal plants or medicinal plants then these books may be of interest aur dusri ab aap iske baad dekh rahe hain kuch books hai that is related to plant physiology physiology jo hai wo ek aisa aspect hai jisse ki jo plant ke processes hain wo aapko samajh mein aate hain इसमें खास करके व्हेन वी टॉक अबाउट फोटोसिंथेसिस रेस्पिरेशन और अदर एस्पेक्ट्स ऑफ न्यूट्रिएंट अपटेक तो इसलिए इसमें आप देख रहे हैं ये प्लांट पैथोलॉजी सॉरी प्लांट फिजियोलॉजी की है इरोइंडीज द्वारा रिटर्न उसके बाद प्लांट फिजियोलॉजी डॉक्टर एडविन ऑक्सोल की है फिर है फंडामेंटल्स ऑफ क्रॉप फिजियोलॉजी व्हेन प्लांट्स आर ग्रोन ऑन लार्जर स्केल फॉर कमर्शियल फार्मिंग पर्पज तो क्रॉप कहलाती है तो वो है इसके अलावा जो है इसमें अब हम गार्डन्स की अगर बात करते हैं तो जब आप गार्डन को थिंक करते हैं उन्हें लार्जर पर्सपेक्टिव तो व्हेन यू विजिट गार्डन्स तो उसका भी बहुत ज़्यादा आपको बेसिक नॉलेज यूजफुल होता है उनमें से जैसे एक ये है लंडन गार्डन्स की एक बुक है जो कि आप देख रहे हैं लंडन गार्डन्स और ये बुक जो है लॉर्डा पार्कर द्वारा लिखित है इसके बाद फिर एक बुक है फोटोग्राफ्स गार्डनिंग में फोटोग्राफी का बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट रोल है तो उसके एस्पेक्ट को ध्यान में रखते हुए है ये बुक काफी और बुक्स हैं गार्डनिंग से रिलेटेड अब हम आ जाते हैं फील्ड गाइड के बाद में जैसे अफ, फ्लावर फॉर एवरी डे ये भी एक अच्छी बुक है फिर ये प्रैक्टिकल जब हम लॉन्स की बात करते हैं तो लॉन में भी काफ़ी बुक्स आती हैं ये गार्डन लॉन्स एंड गार्डन कवर्स है इसके बाद ये लैंडस्केपिंग की कुछ और बुक है फिर इसके बाद आ जाता है लैंडस्केपिंग के लिए जो अलग अलग प्लांट्स है फिर ये बहुत अच्छी बुक है ग्राउंड फोर्स ये एल एन की बुक है जो कि काफ़ी ज़्यादा एक्सपर्टीज रखते हैं गार्डनिंग और लैंडस्केपिंग में इसके बाद फिर ट्रॉपिकल प्लांट्स जो कि गार्डनिंग में यूज होते हैं उसके ऊपर भी सो विल टेक अ लुक ऑन द फ्रंट ऑफ द बुक वन बाय वन तो ये आप देख रहे हैं जैसे कि हमने बात किया आयुर्वेदा तो ये बुक एक जस्ट ब्रीफ आइडिया देता है आपको कि वाट एग्जैक्टली आयुर्वेदा इज यू कैन गो थ्रू दिस बुक जस्ट टू हेल्प यू अंडरस्टैंड देन there is another book herbs now since our main subject is on gardening it is important for us to understand herbs and when we talk about herbs to common herbal plants that we grow is mint then you grow several culinary herbs such as curry leaf plant then we have coleus ajwain the one you remember that has a smell of ajwain but is not a true ajwain because that 
a different plant and uh, another book you can see this is also ayurveda and revel there are certain secrets in ayurveda which normally people are not aware of but we are not going deep into this because that's not our field we will restrict ourselves up to gardening only so uh, before moving on to books that are specifically pertaining to gardening and other aspects of gardening let's take a look on these books also as i was telling you it's plant physiology and cell biology now why cell biology understanding may help us in understanding plants because when we understand cells then we'll be able to know how it functions and what is the physiological aspects of a plant physiology is main aspect that we need to understand because the processes that are covered under our aspect of plant physiology only so be it transpiration be it photosynthesis we need to understand and how nutrient uptake occurs in plant and when we apply any form of nut nutrition in whatever form we are going to apply be it in uh, ground or as foliar application so there is one more book of plant physiology so everything is correlated to gardening we cannot restrict ourselves just to plants and other aesthetic aspects of gardening now let's uh, one more book i thought to show you this is again a plant physiology book this book contains some physical uh, basic aspects of physiology that may be useful to those who are interested to understand plant physiology more so now uh, let's come to this yes now we are going to talk about gardening in true sense so what sort of gardening in general do i talk about it's about home gardening and uh, what kinds of plants are important in home gardening it's house plant so this uh, book generally tells us about common as types of house plants you can go through this book to know about gardening then there is one more plant or uh, book that talks about gardens you see how to take pictures in garden we all, whenever you go to any garden first thing you do you take out your cameras so is a garden photography similar to general that we do in our daily lives no here you need some basic understanding of photographic also aspects also focus and all those things what type of frame you need to present so that books just has to take good photographs in garden then is uh, this book talks about london gardens yes i know i am talking about gardening and that to in perspective of delhi garden aspects in terms of delhi climate and all that so this book is just to give you an idea what forms of knowledge is vast when we talk about gardens and you need not to talk always about plants plants and plants places also are important so this books is just an example of a book that uh, that describes plants that are growing in a particular garden in that particular location on uh, so say for example in february what are the plants you want to see so where that plants are growing in that particular season and how you can reach there so this book tells about major gardens of london in delhi there are also very uh, many gardens for example nehru park or sundar nursery garden where you can take a visit then uh, in march come we have a wonderful 
garden at the president's estate there also you can visit or flowers now this is another book a flower for every day this book is a brief information of throughout the year what changes are occurring in the author's garden and all these things are described in this book even by the quiz now lawn is a very important aspect when we think of gardening on ground so apart from home gardening the major garden aspect is lawn although small lawns are possible in a home garden also but normally lawns play a bigger role when we talk about landscaping landscaping means developing a land into aesthetic value with a, a bigger aspect so to, to help us understand this there is one more book i suggest is ground force this is written by a very well known garden expert alan tishmarsh and he has described everything about so whenever a professional person is planning about a garden then he can go through this book and it guides us step by step how to plan a garden because when we think of landscaping then planning plays a very important role of all garden aspects because you have to apply all garden principles so uh, there are hard elements there are soft elements when we restrict our to soft element then we talk about plants now this book describes tropical plants our climate is more uh, uh, particularly when we are talk about major area then we have subtropical climate so this book may help you to help understand some type of tropical plants that you can grow in your garden during summer now the favorite what we are going to talk about topic is home gardening so this is a good book where the author is describing a various experience this book is published by icr and mr pratibha tribedi tells us about various experiences he has expert uh, experience in gardening where ever she was uh, during her tenure in government service she used to grow a number of plants so she uh, it's description of her own gardening experience so i think this book is good one you can read this so here is a, another book title is teach yourself gardening by pramila mehra this book is good for beginners because it helps us understand basic aspects of gardening principles of gardening so you can go through this book to understand basic aspects of gardening now here is another book by roman kapoor this is also a very gentle book describing many aspects of gardening so for home gardeners this book is good to start and learn about basic aspect a temple rights written book flowers and gardens this book tells about description of plants when you think of some any book that describes plants a to z manner then it is of good help it tells us a lot ab- apart from plants uh, now when we think of gardens then flowers become important so for this we have vishnu sarup book on garden flowers this book also gives us good description about various flowers that can be grown in a garden now here is a book 
you can see its name is gardening guide and uh, this book is written by owners of certain seeds seeds a calcutta based seed farm uh, since we are in delhi there are also delhi based good garden seed uh, suppliers and sellers Let's say for example ronak seeds or omex seed there are many and so imagine them writing a book and describing all the basic aspects of gardening and sharing their experience so it is that kind of book written by owners of sutton seeds this book describes all basic aspects and apart from that it also gives us some insight into organic gardening so this is a again a book that can help beginners and professionals as well uh here is dr ekta choudhry's garden up many of you might be aware of a uh, work of this author well experienced well very knowledgeable so when you are looking for some garden tips that includes sound technical knowledge particularly about various environmental parameters or aspects that need to be taken care of while doing gardening then this book is of good help it is good for beginners and for those who are doing advanced gardening now this is a textbook titled ornamental gardening when we talk of gardening in general it is of course a something that has aesthetic value but when we talk of home gardening in detail then ornamental gardening word brings in our mind ornamental plants the good number of foliage plants that we see around us during summer season some in bloom some without flowers there are colorful foliage plants they they are grown just for their ornamental value in case someone is interested in bonsai then he can get tips from book like this one bonsai tips yes for those also there is a book who wish to plant on rocks so this is a book called rock gardening and this book uh, written by p kachru and priya darbari is providing us basic information on what sort of plants can be grown on rocks they have described many plants that require less water which can be able to sustain this type of hard parameters of water scarcity water stress and even in adverse climate including some succulents also so this book tells about all those plants that can be grown on rocks one more book on indoor gardening written by s d yes it's good for beginners it describes plants in detail then there is one more book by vishnu sharup who's this author we went through the flower book also so this book again describes indoor garden plants you can grow through and the last book currently i am having in my present personal stock is regarding orchids orchids are difficult to grow as compared to other as uh, kind of common regular plant but they can be grown but they need some special care that is very different from the normal regular mixture that we prepare for common house plants so in the and i repeat 
that even though we are having sufficient knowledge of gardening as we ourselves if someone believes then also we should go through gardening books as and when you get time to go through although i know this is the time when people prefer reading blogs more than going through these hard prints read books but still they may be of use up to any extent so even if you are beginner start reading about plants about gardening and do some small basic activities that you can do to begin gardening at home so wish you all a very happy gardening wish you all a good flowers season around you so wish you all the very best go gardening enjoy nature enjoy happiness thank you very much now let's talk about home gardening तो होम गार्डनिंग में भी काफ़ी बुक्स हैं जो कि आप देख सकते जैसे फॉर एग्जांपल ये प्रतिभा पी त्रिवेदी की बुक है जो कि आई का पब्लिकेशन है इसके बाद और बहुत सारी बुक्स हैं गार्डनिंग की जो हम देखेंगे इसमें एक है प्रोमिला मेहना की टीच योर सेल्फ गार्डनिंग इससे मतलब ये है कि आप पहले खुद सीखिए गार्डनिंग तो ये आप उसको प्रैक्टिस करें ऐसी होम गार्डनिंग की एक और बुक है रोमन कपूर की एक और यहाँ पे आप देख रहे हैं सीजनल गार्डनिंग गाइड क्योंकि जब हम गार्डनिंग की बात करते हैं तो सीजन्स का अपना इम्पोर्टेंट होता है एंड यू शुड नो विच प्लांट्स आर कैपेबल ऑफ ग्रोइंग इन विच पर्टिकुलर सीजन एट ए पर्टिकुलर लोकेशन इसके बाद ऐसे ही जब हम गार्डनिंग के सीजन्स की बात करते हैं उनमें फ्लावर सबसे पहले आ जाते हैं तो उसमें विष्णु स्वरूप की एक बुक है गार्डन फ्लावर्स एक और बुक ऐसे ही राइट की है फ्लावर्स एंड गार्डन्स फिर एक और बुक है काफ़ी टेक्निकल एस्पेक्ट्स के साथ में आपको हेल्प करेगा अंडरस्टैंड करने के लिए वो है एकता चौधरी की गार्डन अप फिर आप जब हम बात करते हैं फोलियज प्लांट्स वगैरह की तो उसमें ऑर्नामेंटल गार्डनिंग का वो आस्पेक्ट आ जाता है इसमें कि हम फोलियज प्लांट्स को बहुत ज़्यादा ग्रो करते हैं तो उस पर आपको काफ़ी इन्फॉर्मेशन मिल सकती है ओनामेंटल गार्डनिंग बाय जीएस सैनी अगर आप बोनसाई में इंटरेस्ट रखते हैं तो बोनसाई की डॉर्जिंग डॉर्लिंग इंडस्ट्रे की ये बुक है एसेंशियल टिप्स ये भी छोटी सी एक हैंडबुक टाइप है जो आपको काफ़ी इन्फॉर्मेशन देगी इफ़ यू आर इंटरेस्टेड इन रॉक गार्डनिंग तो यू कैन गो विद पी काचरू और प्रिया जराबी की ये बुक है फिर इंडोर गार्डनिंग की एक बुक है एस सी डे की एक और बुक इंडोर गार्डनिंग में आप पढ़ सकते हैं विष्णु सौरभ के द्वारा लिखी हुई अगर आपको ऑर्किड्स में भी इंटरेस्ट है क्योंकि तो पर्टिकुलर क्लाइमेट डिमांड करते हैं तो उसमें एक ही बुक है ए कंप्लीट गाइड ऑफ ऑर्किड्स तो ये कलेक्शन है मेरा जो कि इतने सालों से गार्डनिंग सेशंस लेने के बावजूद आई कीप रेफरिंग क्योंकि हर ऑथर का अपना एक अलग पर्सपेक्टिव होता है जो कि वो इन्फॉर्मेशन शेयर करते हैं तो आप गार्डनिंग के कितने ही अच्छे जानकारी रखते हो बट आई ऑलवेज सजेस्ट यू टू कीप रीडिंग गार्डनिंग बुक्स आल्सो फ्रॉम टाइम टू टाइम इट विल बी यूजफुल टू यू एट सम स्टेज थैंक यू सो मच